Hello, welcome to another episode of Painting with Mr. Kindergarten. Just as children learn how to read and write, they can also learn how to paint, and I'm here to show you how. Today we're going to do bus and a pickup. This is a continuation of our transportation theme. In another episode, we uh, learned how to paint cars and trucks. So if you haven't seen that yet, look for that episode as well. But even if you haven't seen that, a bus and a pickup are very simple to do. What we're going to do is we're going to start with our black paint. And we're going to put our paper up this way vertically. We're going to fold it in half because we're actually going to do two on the same page. I allow my children to, uh, to do two vehicles on the same page. Actually, when we do our transportation unit, I show them about eight different uh, transportation vehicles and I allow them to choose which two they want to paint. Fire trucks, police cars, regular cars, race cars, all kinds of uh, vehicles, and they get their choice. But right now, I'm going to show you a bus as well as a pickup. To make the bus, we're going to make a wheel right there in front with our black, just a big circle like that. We're going to take our yellow paint and we're going to go straight across the front, join them together right there in the middle. If you get a little black on it, that's okay. Just put it in there and it magically disappears and go like that. Now to make our bus, we're going to go up a little bit, straight up like that. On the back of it, we're going to go up a lot, all the way there, not all the way to the top. We don't want to make a double thicker bus. Now we're going to give uh, this bus a little tiny bit of a, uh, a trunk right there, actually the, the hood. And uh, this is going to be an old-fashioned bus, and I believe the, the new ones are just uh, rectangles. We're going to give it an old-fashioned type. And then we're going to go straight up like this, and then all the way to the back. Now this is the, the outline that we do for the bus. It's also a great outline for a van. In fact, for a van, you might want to put just a little more of a hood before you go up just like that. Now remember, you're going to slide up at this angle, a slightly steeper angle, but it's not straight up, and straight across right there. Now, at this point right here where our angle's changed, we're going to go straight across all the way to the back. And then we're just going to put some lines right here so we can get some people on the bus. And we're going to pretend the door is on the other side. We're not going to worry about that. We're just going to paint this side like that. Again, if you get some black in there, just cover it up with some more yellow. And it can be an older bus. Mix it up there. It's as good as new. And we're done with that. Now, of course, in order to drop the bus, you're going to need right there a T falling over. That's going to be your steering wheel. And let's put some seats in there so people can sit down. And the kids are probably wondering where's the part they sit in. Well, it's actually like an L right here, backwards L, but you can't see the other part because it's behind this part. You can only see the tops of the seats right there. Now, we need red lights in the back for when it stops. And usually they have a little reflector right up there, too. We'll put a little reflector right there. Now, we don't want anybody to get hurt, so we're going to put some bumpers right there as well. And if you want, you can paint in hubcaps. Of course, you can leave them white. Mixing gray paint, painting gray. So that basically is our bus right there. Now, on the bottom part here, I'm going to show you how to make a pickup. A pickup truck. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to start off with two tires. Now I'm going to make a blue pickup. Of course, you can make any color pickup you like. Let me just bring that down so you guys can see the tires right there. And then we're going to do the same thing straight across. Join in the middle, just like that, just like a pair of glasses. We're going to go up just a little bit, straight up just a little bit. We're going to make the hood slanting like that. It's going to be longer than our bus. We're going to slant up at a nice angle, but not straight up. Go across just a little bit, and then down just about to the same level we went here. And all the way back. And you can see it's starting to take the shape of a pickup. Now, the pickup should be actually a bit longer, so I'm going to add some, some to the cab right there. Go straight across right there, and there's your cab. And then, just color in the rest of it. And there's your pickup. Now, we need, of course, our steering wheel. Same thing, a T falling over. And let's give this guy a green chair to sit in. And might as well give them green hubcaps as well. Finish it off with some lights in the front. Get a little red light in the back for when he stops. 
Give them some bumpers. Now, again, you can use a variety of colors here. I just happen to have those colors handy. That's, uh, those are the colors I happen to be using. Now, you can put some stuff in the back. Uh, say, for example, you want this to be a farmer. He's taking his produce to the market. Well, let's put some fences back here. Make sure nothing falls out of this truck. So you can leave it with the, without the fence. You can put the fence in there. You can turn it into a camper by just coloring this in here, similar to what we did in a previous episode. So, again, a variety of vehicles you can use. And uh, once again, thanks for watching. If you have any suggestions, anything you'd like us to, to paint on camera, uh, contact us. You can uh, find us at mrkindergarten.com or facebook.com slash mrkindergarten. Uh, keep teaching with art. And this is Mr. Kindergarten. I'll see you next time. Thanks.